what's up youtube in today's video we're going to be going over every car at simeon's dealership that's available this week in gta online so we're gonna smash that like button smash that sub button and drop a comment thanks so let's start off in this corner we got the dinka kanjo sj this is like a honda in real life nice nice honda civic looking car and it is going for a million three hundred and seventy thousand dollars nice let's drive it front wheel drive huh this car looks really realistic as in looks like the real life honda civic version or model i mean Um, this car has a lot of customizations, as in, it has a lot of options. It's a little bit pricey, and usually when these cars are at Simeon's, they're actually on sale. So this car is probably on sale, and it's still over a million dollars, which I don't know why. Probably because of all the customizations you can do, like I said earlier. This car drives like another average car stock. It must go crazy if you customize it. It definitely does. Huh? I don't have a wanted level. Hold up, let me call my lawyer, aka Lester. Hey, what's going on? Nice. Alright, back to the video. Up next, okay. I'll deal with it. we have the Fister Comet Safari. You can buy this off legendarymotorsports.net. And it looks like they already put some work on this car. Nice. This car is going for $739,070. Pretty good. Pretty good. Let's go test drive it. That's cheaper than that uh car right there. The Dinka Kanjo SJ. This car looks amazing. Yeah, I would definitely buy this car. This car is going for 700, almost 800k. It's nothing. Compared to uh, the last car we just drove, that is nothing. Up next, we have the Lampadati Komoda. Buy this off of Legendary Motorsports. And it doesn't, seem, it doesn't seem to have any cosmetics, but the rims do seem modified. How much is it going for? A million a hundred and ninety thousand dollars. Nice. My vest matches it too. This car sounds amazing already. If you add like an engine upgrade. It would probably rattle and pop, along with some exhaust upgrades too. This car seems very nice. It's obviously going for over a million, but you have to remember it fits four people, so it's good for missions. I also like the name of it, Komodo, like that dragon. Up next, we have the Pegasi Ignis, going for... This car already looks kind of souped up. What's it going for? 
two million seven hundred eighty four thousand three hundred eighty dollars nice pretty good pretty good let's test drive it this is definitely the most expensive car here i mean just look at this bad boy Wow. Wow, I'm speechless. This car sounds amazing. Engines popping. Fast acceleration. Big bore exhaust. I like what I'm hearing. Yeah, you should definitely buy this. This is definitely on sale. And last but not least, maybe it is, you never know. We have the Blista Kanjo, the regular one. So we have the SJ and then we have the Kanjo. Just the plain Kanjo, which is a hatchback. Pretty cool. It comes with a livery already. Sick. You can buy this off Southern San Andreas Super Sports. I just realized that this does not say a website to buy it on. Pretty crazy. But yeah, this car is going for $429,370. Pretty good. Let's test drive it. See what's up. Oh no. Hmm. Wow. Yo, this car has a certain rattle to it. I don't know if you guys are listening to it. Kind of crazy. I like it. Personally, I'm just a huge fan of hatchbacks. Ever since I turned 20 for some reason. I've just been into hatchbacks more. I think since I'm getting old, you know. I'm tired of the two-door. Kind of want a four-wheel drive. I mean, all-wheel drive hatchback. Not bad. Wait, let me see. I think this is front-wheel drive. Yes, it is. Oh, ill. Here's the thing about front-wheel drive. The handling is horrible. Sometimes. Personally, for me, at least. I don't know. That's just me. Maybe I'm just a bad driver, or just how it is. I don't know. I'm more of a RWD guy when it comes to racing. But in real life, I want all-wheel drive. Now I'm going to tell you um, which cars I would buy in today's dealership or in this week's dealership. Let's see. I would not waste my money on the Dinka Kanjo SJ. I would not. Now, the <clears throat> I think I'd waste some money on this Fister Comet Safari though. I mean, it just sounded and looked nice, you know? For the Komodo? Hmm. Honestly, yes. Because this jacket, I mean, this utility vest that I got for doing the Diamond Casino this week matches it. And I would definitely rock this and wear this at the same time. So, yes, I would buy the Komodo value. The Ignis. You know what I'm... You already know what I'm going to say. I, I, already, I already said what I was going to do. Mid-drive. This is a automatic Yes. It's definitely on sale this week. Because, you know, why else it would it be at Simeon's? I'm surprised this isn't at the luxury auto shop over there. A couple streets down. The one a couple streets down. Crazy. And lastly, the Kanjo. Hmm. I like hatchbacks. That's very biased of me. So, yes, I would buy it. But if you're not into these kind of cars, then don't buy it. But this livery is pretty cool. It's pretty clean. So I would probably, yeah, I don't know, up to you. I would buy it, for anyone wondering. And that wraps up today's video. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I hope you're having a great day. What's up, Simeon? Peace!